Well, if you watch the Morning Brew if, if, at all, you know that we love tech and we love startups and we love entrepreneurial stories. We have all that rolled into one guy yes, over here. One young, very successful superstar. Yeah. In the uh, in the startup game. Hello. Uh, I want you to meet Matthew Ayub, who is founder of a company called Media Trove, and Media Trove is the company doing a, another company called Canoodle. That's right. Yeah. Matthew, good to meet you. Yeah, nice to meet you. Thanks for having me. Thank you. And I see on your shirt you've got uh, some ace notes there, so it must yes. have to do with music. That's right. Yeah, so Canoodle is a background music service, and when I say background music, I mean music that you hear in restaurants and stores. So we stream music into a business and allow their customers to interact with and influence that music. And how do the customers get to pick the music? Yeah, so they use their mobile device, you know, whether it's their iPad or their phone, and they can uh, basically vote on songs and uh, they log in with Facebook, so we take their music preferences from Facebook and their votes, and we try and determine what everyone likes and play the best that song. Is yeah. Brilliant! I love wow. it. Wow, you're kind of the new Muzak, right? Mm -hmm. That's yeah. Yeah, I, I know you hate that comparison, but <laughs> no, it, we're, it's uh, what it is. We're trying to do basically what they do, but a lot better and a lot more customized. It's so. like a modern-day jukebox. A little bit, yeah. Yeah. So if I'm in a hip clothing store. I'm going to hear different music than I would in a, like a quiet restaurant. Yeah, so, uh, you know, each business is able to sort of set some constraints for what they want the music to be like in their business, and then within those constraints, the customers can sort of dictate the experience, and uh, it'll change, you know, based on which customers are in the store at any given time. So how is this different from Pandora? So Pandora is uh, a consumer-facing app. It's, you know, for your individual use and uh, our services for businesses, so for groups of people when they're in a restaurant or a store. Right. I just can't even imagine, like, okay, I want to hear Radiohead while I'm having my, you know, sushi, and then yeah. I walk in and I hear Radiohead. Yeah. Is that how that's, it kind of works? That's pretty similar to how it works. So you would, you know, pull out your device and check in at that location, and you get to start voting on the songs and uh, seeing, seeing the history of the songs that have played if you want to, you know, go back and see what you discovered there. So. So it makes it even more entertaining. Yeah, definitely. A lot more interactive and entertaining and enjoyable. How did you come up with this? Uh, it was sort of just seeing what was being done in the music space already and uh, applying those innovations to the commercial music side because mm -hmm. uh, there's been a lot of innovation on the uh, personal music consumption, you know, with Pandora and Spotify and online services like that. But taking all those innovations and bringing them over to the commercial space and really helping businesses to engage with their consumers and uh, create a better experience in their stores. And if you're the business owner, you want the right kind of music to match the people that are in your store at the time. That's right. Yeah, music could have such a big impact on you know their uh, their mood and uh, you know whether or not they even come back to your store at all. So having the right music at the right time for the right people is really important. Like when, when Larry and I go to breakfast, I'm going to plug in Let It Go, because that's his favorite <laughs> song, so that he can enjoy Let It Go yeah. while we're having our meeting. Yeah, there you go. Do you go. like that? Yeah. Okay. Can we do that? I'm thinking about how to apply this to our daily lives, you know. <laughs> I'm going to change the subject now. Uh, Matthew, <laughs> I, I, where are you at in your rollout on this? Sure. So we're getting ready to launch our pilot program, which is going to be mostly with local businesses. Uh, so we'll do our pilot program locally and then do a national rollout after that. And uh, that's uh, just getting ready. So hopefully later this month, early next month, uh, we'll be announcing which businesses we're starting in on our Facebook page. Canoodle. Fascinating. And you're yeah. going to have a national footprint with this. Yeah, that's the idea. So the entire U.S. will, uh, you know, is, that's what our music licensing allows us to do. And so that's what we'll be pushing for. Are you going to stay in Albuquerque when you become a billionaire? <laughs> sure. <laughs> I, I, I really like Albuquerque a it's lot. It's such so. a great idea. Thank and you. I can see it having application in absolutely every business. Yeah, I think it's uh, you know, something every business can find a lot of use for. Mm -hmm. so. I love the idea. Uh, so Canoodle, Canoodle is, well, you've seen the URL on the screen. And you can go there and find out more. And if I have a business locally and want to get in the beta program, can, can people still do that? Yeah, absolutely. So uh, they could go to our website, uh, mediatrove.com, which is the company website, 
and send us an email or find us on Facebook or uh, I'm, I'm around all the startup events so they could find me at those as well. Wow. Amazing. Right young talent uh, here. Amazing. Yeah, he'll, we'll, he won't remember us when he hits it big, you know, but, <laughs> but that's we'll okay. Remember him. That's right. <laughs> remember that guy We're we like had this. on? Yeah, we are. Hey, Matthew, uh, great stuff. And Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank uh, you. Your, your success. And this Thanks. is a great idea. Good luck going forward. Thank you Matthew so much. A. Thanks U. for having me. With Canoodle, his company, MediaTrove.com, uh, another superstar in the making here on The Morning Group. Indeed. We'll be right back with the noms in just a moment. Some music.